Slani everybody, I am Corvus Uruchurgenikos and this is Starting Out Solitary. I'm your Wednesday host and this week we are addressing the topic of which bottles or which jars and uh, if we use them or not and why and what for if we use them. And the short answer for me is no, I don't use them. But the reason is not necessarily that I don't like them or that I don't want to work with them, is that I feel that some of their uses can be dangerous and I'm new to the path, I go on a slow pace, I'm learning on my own. Uh, basically, learning historical witchcraft, uh, practical claims and then going to try and commit mistakes and then try again and since I'm open to commit mistakes they better be mistakes that won't end up fucking me up on a high scale like if they're like smaller mistakes that I can fix that's better so since I don't feel experienced enough I'm not trying them yet but I'm totally up and open for trying them because I'm open to any uh, practice that is traditionally or historically if you want magical and witchy and witch bottles definitely are but I'm not sure yet and I think if you're on your own no one is guiding you no one can um, fix your mistakes and you think that you can fuck it up then better don't fuck it up so I will keep learning I will keep reading I will keep practicing on smaller things and when I feel experienced enough or I've got a spirit guide or a familiar spirit that uh, give me better guidelines than just reading books then I will try, but I'm totally open to it, uh, especially for protection and to house familiar spirits or spirit guides or animal spirits or whatever that needs a house. Um, in the way that I practice witchcraft, spirits are the source of all magic and sometimes you, you have a pact with a spirit, so you give them something they help you in return and sometimes those spirits um, inhabit uh, fetishes or objects or things like figures, puppets uh, or sometimes witch bottles or witch jars so I'm open to all of that I hope that I don't need to curse but they can be used for cursing too but yeah not using them, totally open to using them. That's my final answer. So tell me what you think in the comments down below. Um, subscribe to this awesome channel, this awesome collaborative channel. Check the other hosts and sub-hosts, which they also have great answers and they provide uh, sometimes much more information than I, than I do. And yeah, pour your thoughts on the comments. See you next Wednesday. Bye.